What's up everyone? Welcome to day number eight of your Momentum program. This is your level two legs burnout workout. So grab your dumbbells and let's get started. What's up everyone? Welcome to day number eight of your Momentum program. We're gonna level it up from last week's leg workout, meaning I want you to think of these exercises as Here's my previous best weight that I was using. Now I'm gonna step it up just a little bit more, okay? So we're gonna be rocking in straight sets today, making sure you get time for each exercise to bump it up on its own, three rounds. Make sure you have your water, your sweat towel, and some form of slider. If you have them, I'll be using our Royal Change sliders, which we launched this past weekend in black, pink, and turquoise. So if you don't have some, you can grab them at the link in the description. As for my weights today, I'm gonna to be ranging in between 10 and 25 or 30 pounds. 30 pounds will be for my goblet squat in the beginning, lighter weights for things like step ups and lunge pulses, okay? So grab a bench as well for those step ups. We're gonna jump right into your warm up. Thumbs up if you're ready. All right, here we go. Take it down, three, two, one, let's go. Stretch out the hamstrings a little bit. Really excited to be here with you today. Really excited to push myself right along with you. Today officially marks 30 weeks pregnant for me. Very pumped about that. Very excited to feel so good. Okay, walk it out. Pike position, pedal your heels down left and right. And I'm really encouraged by everyone just kind of cheering me on and really thankful that there's so much positivity around being a strong athlete, no matter what phase of life you're in. So always we'll provide modifications, step it up, dial it back to make sure these workouts suit everyone and challenging their strength. Drop down to your knees, reach your hips back and forward. Here we go. Always know these workouts, I'm gonna give you the format, the guidelines. It's up to you to pick a weight that challenges you. It's up to you to pick a tempo, an intensity that really pushes you. We often think about a tempo or a pace and then I say push a little harder and you find a little bit deeper that you can go just a bit more. So I want you to take yourself there today. All right, left leg up top, drop the back knee down. Good, lift your hips up. Good stretch in the front and back down. And lift it up. One more, take it down. Nice, thorough warm up here today. Always gotta make sure we're ready to work hard. Lift it up, two, one, and take your foot back, and let's just switch it over to the other side. Okay, bend and straighten. Here we go, down. And lift. Great work, down. And lift. And we'll go one more, take it down, open your chest up, really stretch the hip. And lift it up, good job. Straight legs, turn your feet open. We're gonna go bent leg, straight leg from the side, getting the inner thighs a little bit. Good job, three, two, stop in the middle here. Hands on the floor, open your chest up. Reach to the ceiling. Good job, we'll get started in just about 30 seconds with a goblet squat. Okay, walk it back in. Feet just outside of your hips and let's just move in a squat. Body weight first. Great job, all right, 10 seconds. Let's go for it, 45 seconds of goblet squats. Okay, three, two, let's go. Sit and push. Nice work, think of bending at the hips and the knees at the same time. Keep your chest up. Good, push into the entire foot. So your heels, your midfoot, and your toe, all of it should be pushing down. 15 seconds. Three, 
three, two, one. Great job. Let's go heavier in weight or pick up the tempo. Less rest at the top, okay? So you give me more reps per working set. Okay, heavier weight, faster tempo. You pick your challenge. Two, one, let's get it. Great job. If you need a target to make sure you're consistent, feel free to tap down on your bench or a box, okay? There's always options there. Good job, 15 seconds. Everyone picks up the tempo, let's go. Keep it up, keep it up. Rest, all right, last round, let's go. Heavier or faster, more reps per working set. Last round or last 15 seconds, I'm gonna tell you to turn it up, so let's go. Two, one, go. Thirty seconds, come on. Turn it up a little bit more. Good job. All right, last 15, turn it all the way up, go. Go quicker, seven, more reps, five, three, two, one, great work. All right, moving on, grab water if you need it. Two pulses and a lunge kick back, okay? So we're taking it here, step back, one, two, lift, stand. One, two, lift, stand. On that little lift, I just want a good glute squeeze. You're gonna be alternating legs throughout the whole first round. Here we go, three, two, one, come on. Down, down, squeeze, switch. And on that squeeze, you're in just a little bit of a hinge, right? Bent at the hip just a little bit. Keep your hips straight though. Don't open them up. Keep your core tight. 10 seconds. Two, one, rest. Round number two, you're leaving the left leg right here. We're gonna go down, down, lift. Down, down, lift. Okay? Let's go, three, two, one, go. On that lift, you're just shifting your weight up to the front foot, and then we shift it back to both feet. Good, try and get back into the lunge and spend as much time here as you can. 15, let's go. Good. Sit down, down. Two, one. All right, breathe for 15, and we switch legs. Same move, okay? Down, down, lift. I want you here as much as possible. Four, three, two, let's go. If you find yourself losing balance, make sure your knee isn't caving in here, okay? Keep it out over your pinky toe edge. Lift, keep it out. Mm -hmm. 
Come on. 10, 9. Three, two, one. Great job, grab water. Your next move, plie squat. Calf raise at the bottom, calf raise at the top. Okay, so you're going down, lift, up, lift. Up, up, okay? So just think of your hips continuing to move up and down. You're constantly pushing your heels up off the ground. Okay, two dumbbells or one right here. We go in five. Three, two, one, come on. Good job. As you're sitting, when you roll up onto your toes, keep your hips there and just push your whole body up. Fifteen. Three, two, one, good job. Now if you can go heavier, I want you to do that. Whether that be one dumbbell or two. Let's go, five seconds. Two, one, come on. You're either heavier or you're giving me more reps per working set. Come on, turn it up. Think about getting your heel closer to your calf. Great job, 15, come on. Two, one, and you've got one last round. On this one, I want you to increase your calf raises, okay? Give me more calf raises. Down, up, down, up. Just stay light on your toes. Two, one, last round, come on. Good, what that does is also force you to get more squats in. Yep, <laughs> progressive overload. Come on, up and up. Great work, 13. Come on, I know your legs are burning. Push, push, push. Six, five, four, two, one, and rest. 30 seconds to breathe. Your next move is gonna involve putting your dumbbell on your back right here on your traps if you can, okay? You're gonna go there, staggered squat, step back. Okay, so you're here, you're gonna step back, squat, squat, okay? It's not a lunge, just a little bit of a stagger, okay? This toe is down, this foot's doing most of the work, all right? And you're just here and here. Let's go. Three, two, one. Step it out. Good, and if you are here with your dumbbell on your back, feel free to open your chest up just a little bit as you sit. Okay, instead of rounding a little bit, maybe too much, try to open here. Good job, you can probably guess what's coming, right? Just staggering the left leg. So we move here, okay? Do not let it shift here. Keep the hips level, keep the shoulders level. Core is engaged, weight is up front. Two, one, let's go. 
and same thing. Feel free to tap your glutes down onto a box or a bench. Don't let this happen though. Don't shift to the side. Everything is level. Come on, keep it moving, keep it moving. That's it, eight, seven. Two, one, good, 15 seconds rest. And we go to the other leg, all right? So we had right foot out front, now we switch. Doesn't have to be too far behind. Four, three, two, let's get it. 45 seconds here. Great job, how you doing? Good, I have a feeling I heard something positive there, right? Doing great, Sydney. Feeling amazing, I knew it. <laughs> 10 more seconds, come on. Two, one, great job. Come on up, grab some water. We're moving into a slider circuit. Whew. All right, so if you have your towel, slider, anything that will move on the surface that you are working out on, go ahead and grab it. All right, anybody else feeling strong? Good, I want you to say yes here. So we've got slider, reverse lunges. We did these last week, but I want you to try and step it up a little bit in terms of weight that you're using, okay? Or if you used something to balance last week, Trying to go right here, just use your body, just your core. Okay, so reverse lunges, round number one. Toes are on the slider, heels are down. Okay, you can see my heels are down. I'm gonna switch, switch. Ready, let's go in five seconds. Three, two, one, here we go. Alternate for the first round. The heel out front stays down. You come right back up on top. Here we go, last 12. And rest, good. You know what's coming. <laughs> Leave one leg here so you can move the slider off of it if you want. Grab a weight if you would like. Okay, we're just moving the left leg. Three, two, one, let's go. Left leg only. Try not to let it go straight back and just bend over. I really want you to sit in a lunge and come right on top of that heel. There you go, really depend on that front leg. Speed it up if you can. Six, five, three, Stay right here on this leg. Go in and out. 30 seconds here. Stay right here. Move your arms. Good job. You're in a half squat here. 30 seconds right here. Come on, this is level two. This is leg burnout. This is what we ask for, right? This is how we get stronger. Stay right here for eight more seconds. Seven. Rest, good. Switch the slider over to the other leg. 
okay? So now, left leg stays, right leg moves. Regular lunges for 45. Three, two, one, come on. Using your weight or your body weight. Good job. Keep breathing. Good form here is everything. Don't let the hips swivel. Something I see often, this, okay, or this. Stay centered. Leg goes right back, right back up. Seven seconds. Here we go, three, drop it down. Stay here, two, one, let's go. Straight back. Good, stay seated. You got 10 more seconds, sit a little lower. Seven. Two, one, and rest. You've got one more round of alternating and we're done with reverse lunges. Okay, just to even it out here. All right, 45 seconds, let's go. Three, two, one, come on. Now, just a hint, these will change every 15 seconds. So right now, we're alternating. Second 15, you're gonna move just your left leg. Three, two, just the left leg. Go right here. Five seconds, you're gonna switch this. Three, two, Switch it over and here's your last 15 seconds for this last 45 working set. Nine, eight, get lower, seven. A little lower for three, two, one. And come up and grab some water. Shake your legs out, don't leave your sliders yet. Whew. This middle kind of going past halfway point. A lot of control, a lot of burn, okay? And if you don't have a slider, just move in the same way, right? All right, lateral lunges. Whew. Toes are on top. Okay, same thing with the reverse lunges. Heels are down. We're gonna start off, sit here, switch. Sit here, switch. If you can, grab a dumbbell, okay? Let's go in three. Ready, two, one, come on. I do want you to go all the way up and down instead of staying here. Okay, sit, come back together. So you're using your inner thighs to pull those heels back together. Seven. Two, one, great work. Whew. The left leg move or stays here. Right leg goes out and up. Okay, keep this knee on the outer edge of your foot. Do not let it cave. Two, one, let's go. Sit, stand. Keep thinking about your hips too. Okay, if they're here and your knee's only going forward, it's gonna be a lot of pressure on your knee. If they sit back, your knee doesn't have to take as much of an angle. Sit back and then down. Five seconds, four, three, take it out to the side for me and stay here, go, go. That's 
That's it. Beautiful job. This leg is where you should be feeling it right now. Woo, 15 more seconds. Sit, 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 come on, nine, eight, go seven, six, five, nice. Three, two, one, okay, stand up. Ow, <laughs> other leg, 15 seconds. Normal range of motion up and down for 45 and then a 30 second burn. Two, one, let's go. about your heels coming back together. Beautiful work. Keep all the weight over here. You're just getting this other leg out of the way. It's off to the side. Inner thighs squeeze back together, but don't put pressure out here. Nine. Three, drop it down and stay down. Two, one, let's go. 30 seconds, come on. And then we'll hit that last round of 15, 15, 15. Nice work, come on, come on. 14, 13, 12 more seconds. Stay here. Three, two, one. Okay. Toes on the slider. You can just bend over, put your hands on your knees for a second. Okay, 15 seconds alternating. Let's go. Four, three, two, one. You sit and stand. 15 right here. Come on. Two, one, just the right leg, go. Good, five more seconds and we switch. Go four, three, two, one, stay low, switch. And go for 15. Then we're moving on, no more sliders for now. Nine, eight, seven. Three more, three, two, one, and rest. Get those sliders out of the way. Good work. We're moving on to step ups, a little bit more fun. Great job, not that those aren't fun. Fun in different ways. You may think both of them or neither of them are fun. Either way, I'm having a good time knowing that you're here. Step ups, three rounds, 45 seconds, alternating, okay? Left and then right. Let's go in three. Two, one, come on. We're close to the end of the workout, so rest periods are going to dwindle. I need to keep this mind-muscle connection going. I need to keep your muscles under tension. I need to keep you mentally focused to just put pedal to the metal. Fifteen seconds. Three, two, one. Let's go. Alternating again. A little heavier if you can. If you're not comfortable with heavier, can you give me a front rack? Open it up here, a little bit more core. One of the two. Heavier weights. Or give me that front rack. Let's go. If you're using a front rack, very easy for this to happen. Whoop. Okay, keep coming straight up. Hip goes straight up. Yes, good job. Stay in it. Stay in this with me. I'm making this one kind of like a little mental breather, right? 
Eight more seconds. You're gonna do the same thing last round and we're gonna advance the hold. Two, one, great job. If you started here, I want you to go front rack. If you did front rack, can you advance it to overhead? Any of those are available as an option or just heavier dumbbells. Okay, let's go. Three, two, one, come on. If you're going overhead, again, very easy to let the hip go whoop. Keep it here. Core is neutral. Exhale and get your hip back on top of your heel. There you go. 30 more seconds of a powerful you. Full body here, right? Yes, we can. Let's go. Push, push, push. Come on, turn it all around for yourself today. You're feeling stronger. Five seconds. Four, two, one. Amazing work. Great job. Grab some water. Oh, water, there we go. Nice work. We're coming back over to the bench. Just a quick minute burn here, okay? Give me your left leg on top of the bench, okay? Just want you to tap it, boom, boom, okay? If you need to slow that down, step up, step back. Let's go. Find a spot on the floor, stare at it. You're not coming all the way up. Just keeping that little half bent position for 15 more seconds. Dig the heel down, come on. In seven, we switch legs, you keep going. Two, one, step up, switch and go. 30 seconds here. If you're on the floor, no bench, same thing, tap in and out. Keep all the weight in the front. You got 15 more seconds. Let's go. Focus, focus, four. Speed it up, three, two, one. All right, let's hit the back of the legs. Hamstring curls with your sliders. Either lay it down or you can come onto your hands. Glute bridge position, okay? Heels are on the sliders. I'm gonna take it a second to show you options. This is a tough move, okay? Most advanced, you're gonna be down on the floor, hands here, hips up, extend and pull. Okay, to dial it back one from there, one leg at a time. Okay, to dial it back one from there, give me a second, you're gonna come up seated, okay? Lift your glutes off the ground, speed that up. Okay, let's go together, three, two, one, and we're off. As you pull your heel back under your glute, I want you to think about your heel lifting your glute too, not just bending again, but bending and pushing. Good job, 10 more seconds, come on. Two, one, great work, drop it down, rest. Straighten your legs out, two more rounds. Can you challenge yourself more? I really need you to squeeze those glutes together when you pull your heel back under. Don't think of bending your knee, think of bending your knee to get your heel under your glutes. Round two, let's go. Stretch, squeeze, stretch, squeeze. Nice work, you got 15 seconds. Let that sweat fall, you're earning it, come on. Four, three, 
four, and rest. One more time through. Really show me what you've got here. Genuinely, I mean that. Turn it up somehow. Have confidence, whether that be just lasting the whole time and not resting, or turning it up a little bit more. Two, one, let's go, come on. The hamstring's job is to bend the knee, okay? Just like your bicep. It is the bicep of the leg. Flex that hamstring. Nice work, come on, come on. 20 seconds. Six, give me two more each leg. One, one, two, two, and rest. Oh, beautiful job, stand up for me. We're gonna move into a final three minute finisher. No sliders, okay? Just one or two light dumbbells, okay? No sliders. Three commands that you're gonna be listening for for three rounds. Pulse, shift left, shift right, okay? We're gonna be in a squat. I'm gonna tell you, pulse. You just keep doing whatever I say until I say another command. So pulse, stay here until I say shift left. Okay, seven seconds and we're gonna go. Ready? Whew. Have a seat. Three, two, one, and we pulse. Good, shift right. Keep the pulse going. Shift left. Middle pulse. On your toes, lift those heels up. 15 more seconds, you stay right here. Stay, stay, stay. Three, and rest, good. One down, two to go. Okay, just listen for my command. Grab your weight or just a glute band, three, two, pulse in the middle. Let's go, down. Shift left. Shift right, good. And middle, hold, no pulse. Lift your heels. 15 more seconds, stay here. Stay, stay, stay. Two, one, rest. All right, last round. We're just gonna be pulsing and holding, pulsing and holding. This is it, you do have 60 seconds straight here, so get your mind right. Three, come on, let's go, two. One, sit. No pulse, just hold. Pulse. Sit. Roll up onto your toes. Pulse on your toes. 30 more seconds, come on, do not stop, do not quit. Sit, stay on your toes. Drop down to your heels, sit, sit, sit. Dumbbells at your chest, sit, lower, come on. Pulse, 12, 11, match my pace. Nine, eight, seven, six, hold for five, four, three, Two, one, and rest. Leg day level two, you've made it to your cool down. Whew. Drop down to your hands and knees. 
Big deep breath out. <sighs> Great work today. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and give the video a thumbs up before you head out. Comment, crushed it before you go, but we got a little cool down first to make sure you feel good for tomorrow's workout, which you're gonna love. <sighs> All right, shift your hips side to side. Give them a little glute stretch. Great job, come up onto your knees, kick your left heel out front, straight leg, fold over it if you can. Amazing work today. We hit a lot of the leg, right? Quads and hamstrings and calves. Without question, we hit some glutes in there as well, just because it's impossible to turn them off when you're working lower body. Switch legs. Great work today. My mission for you today was to keep you moving, keep you squatting, keep you stepping. Great work, pull your toe back towards your knee. The time under tension today, a little bit of a switch up for exercise challenges. That was level two. Next week, level three, I'm gonna challenge you to push even harder, maybe some variations, but still, it's just about progressing you in terms of the way I challenge you, okay? Whew. All right, come into the middle, same position, just take that leg out to the side, and I want you to sit back if you can. Okay, a little inner thigh stretch here. If this is not comfortable to you, take it down to the floor all the way. Great job. Go ahead and switch legs. Same stretch. Good work today. Challenging yourself is not always mentally easy or physically, but mentally and physically you benefit. You benefit from pushing through that initial barrier of thinking I don't want to because it's gonna be hard because I might fail. And you benefit in terms of physical strength, just knowing, yeah, I'm gonna get through this and I'm gonna know next time that I can do it as well. So I'll continue to do the things that challenge me in order to get stronger. Both legs out to the side, reach forward with your belly button. Okay, so it's not always about the perfect workout, it's about the best execution of every rep. Trying to stay in that rep as much as you can. Trying to stay in that battle almost, right? Where you know you're getting stronger, you're just kind of fighting, okay? This is one of those battles you're going to win. If you just keep showing up, you're not gonna lose with consistency. You're not gonna lose with challenging yourself to get stronger. It is a win-win for you. The battle might be tough, but the outcome is always to your benefit. All right, bringing in both soles of your shoes together, fold over top, and we'll stand up and finish it off with a standing quad stretch right after this. See if you can take your hand and push your knee down to the ground. And other side. All right, make your way up to standing however you can, whatever feels good to you, take your time. And as we just close this workout out, remember, this battle is always to your benefit. You don't show up for the battle, yeah, you won't face a challenge, but you also won't reap the benefits. Show up for these battles. I think of a workout as a battle for mental and physical gain. Switch legs. The battle is always to your benefit. Great job. All right, shake your legs out as you head out today. Do me a quick favor, make sure you're still sharing these workouts. Make sure you're encouraging people in the comments below and you're checking in. Give this video a thumbs up to let me know that you crushed it. Subscribe to the channel and turn on your notifications and I'll let you know when I post your next workout. But like I said, comment day or level two leg day crushed. I'll see you for our next one. Bye everyone. Amazing work today. I'm so proud of you. Don't forget to check out the description to grab your royal change sliders or your yoga mat or your jump ropes and check the video out that I've linked for you right here for a little more work, a stretch video right down here and subscribe to the channel right down there. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye everyone.